Hi my beauties, welcome back to my channel. I've missed you guys so much but I was so sick for a whole weekend. Now that I'm feeling so much better, I decided to film a very dramatic Valentine's Day look. It's just perfect for those nights that you really want to be more dramatic and you've been a while with your man so you just want to show him a little something, you know? But to get started with this tutorial, first you need to prime your eyes. I'm using the Urban Decay Anti-Aging Primer Potion and I'm just applying this with my ring finger and also blending it with my ring finger. So now taking the color Dust from our Naked 3 palette, we're going to apply this all over our eyelid. You really want to be careful because this really is really dusty. I mean, you have a lot of fallout, but later on I will be applying my eyeshadow shields, but just letting you know a heads up. So now taking the color Limit, we're going to apply this right on top of our crease as a transition color. Now taking the color Dark Side, we're going to start applying this right on our crease and then forming an outer V. And then don't forget to blend that out. Then to darken it up more, we're going to take the color black heart and we're really going to start intensifying our outer V shape. And again, don't forget to start blending this up. Now this is totally optional, but you you could also go back and reapply some of the color dust. And then just don't forget to blend that out. For our highlight, I'm going to be taking the color Strange and applying this on my brow bone. Now taking off our eyeshadow shields, we are going to focus on our bottom lash line and I'm taking whatever was left of black heart on my pencil brush and just applying this. Now taking a black eyeliner, you're going to want to start outlining your tight line and your waterline. Then after you've done your winged eyeliner, um, go ahead and apply a few coats of mascara, preparing them for the falsies. The falsies that I used today was Temptress by House of Lashes. And then after you are done applying them, don't forget to run one more time your eyeliner. That way you can get rid of the shininess of the glue. Then I am taking black heart again and just going back and really intensifying my crease. And then softly blending this out. Now focusing on the face, I have already primed my skin and applied my foundation. This is the foundation that I used today, it was the Sephora Perfect Mist Airbrush Foundation. And now focusing on the concealer, I use MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NW25 and use the beauty blender to blend all of this out. So for contouring, I used my Benefit Hula Bronzer and just started contouring my cheeks, my jawline, and all around my forehead. blush I am using the balm and stain blush in Argyle and just applying this on the apples on my cheeks and now to set our concealer I am using this hourglass ambient lighting powder in diffuse light And 
now to give some glow to my face, I'm using NARS Albatross and just applying this right on top of my blush and somewhat on top of my eyebrow and down my nose and on my chin. Now for the lips, I decided to use Lime Crime's Pink Velvet. I think it's perfect for that day because you don't have much to worry about with your lips. You could eat and drink whatever you want because this does not go anywhere. And now to finish the look, just apply a few coats to your bottom lashes. And with that, we are done. Give this a thumbs up if you really did enjoy it. If you're not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. I love you all.